Shawan, Kahanga Ingai Haba Shmiao Shai, Bashan Rakakudash, Devil Nuns to the Elves and the Apostles, of Graven Stone Who Well, Shawan to the 144,000, and one third remnant man, woman, and children of the whole for Lay Shawan. This is the brother Kabari Yash coming back at you with another lesson. This is being a parent, how about seeing y'all share a prayer? And let's be able to find this grace point. But before I get started with this lesson, I want to show you, brother, something, man. Okay? Because he, that goes to show you that <laughs> we're close to the family of the word, man. All right? We are very close. Because these devils, they've been doing this shit lately. Let me show you what happens when I try to share a video. Okay? Show y'all some. Now, I go here. I type, you know, watch, share, and subscribe. Watch what pops up. You see that? This crap pops up. One time verification needed. Now, why in the world do we need to verify, you know, my channel? And I use my channel. All right? This is crazy. This shit pops up. And it not only pops up. Now, this wasn't even popping up on the, uh, when you know, I'm, because, you know, I like to share brother's lessons, you know. And, uh, this wasn't popping up. It started popping up when, you know, you try to, um, <clears throat> you know, share an article or something like that. And then this started popping up. But, you know, it'll still let you. Post the article in the description box. Now it's starting to pop up when you post articles or now starting to share lessons. So this goes to show you that this devil is hurt, man. Alright? This crap pops up. Okay? That goes to show you that we are close to the family of the word. These devils are... <laughs> these devils are hurt, man. Okay? Now they can't want to allow you to, you know... Now, I went to my uh backup channel, and it allowed me to, you know, share Brother's Lesson. So, I guess I'm going to have to go on my backup channel and do this, man, because, okay, let me just do another one. Okay. Let's see. Let's go to another one. Okay. Because I was trying to share, you know, certain Brother's Lessons, and it won't let me. Let's see some. Let's go here. Let's try the Brother. I'm one of bad, although I already shared the brother lesson, our live lesson already. But let's see. Let's show you. Post. This crap pops up. This crap pops up, man. Okay. This crap pops up. So, yeah. This is wild, man. This is wild. These devils are doing this shit on purpose, man. I just wanted to let you brothers know this, man, because <laughs> and these devils they hurt, man. Okay? So, without further ado, I just wanted to show you that. That was a little quick PSA, man. A little public service announcement, man. Okay? So, without further ado, let's get into the lesson, man, because <laughs> these devils are hurt, man. And to show you how more hurt they are, now this is what these devils are doing now. Okay? This is from the People's Voice TV, and it says ADL calls on U.S. government to scrap the First Amendment to protect Israel. So now they want to get rid of the First Amendment. <laughs> so man, look, we at we close to the family of the word, man. Okay, so let's read a little bit of this. It says the Anti-Defamation Defamation Defamation League, which is ADL has called on the Biden regime to scrap the First Amendment in America in order to protect Israel from anti-Sam and hate. Unbelievable. The ADL, in coordination with the Conference of Presidents of Major American JWO's organization, is demanding that Congress renew special provisions in the FISA, which is stands for Foreign Intelligence Surveillance Act, to allow for the silencing of any American who in any way criticized Israel's genocide in 
Gaza. So, here we go, man. Okay? Let's get a, let's get a couple of scriptures. Because these devils are hurt, man. <laughs> they hurt. Butt hurt, man. Alright, let's go here. Galatians 4 and 16. Am I therefore become your enemy because I tell you the truth? And the answer is yes. And you devils are getting defeated. Amalek is butthurt over the truth, man. Okay? So now they want to scrap the First Amendment, man. And you all know the First Amendment. You know, we got the freedom of speech in that. Okay? So now they want to scrap that. Let's go here. Isaiah 29 verse 15. Woe well, unto them that see deep to hide their counsel from the glory and how about Shion Shine. Their works are in the dark, and they say, Who seeth us and who knoweth us? Yeah. The glory and how about Shion Shine see devils, man. And you devils have been exposed. The, the veil is being lifted, man. Let's get that. Isaiah 25 verse 7. And he will destroy in this mountain the face of the covering cast over all people and the veil that is spread over all nations, man. So that veil is being lifted up now, okay? So not only these devils are messing with the YouTube channels, right? They mess with me, okay? They mess with, literally, they mess with everybody, every brother, man, okay? Because, you know, brothers' videos are getting shadow banned, you know, unless it's getting taken down. So, you know, we close to the family of the word, man. Okay. Let's go here. Deuteronomy 33 and 29. And we're going to go back to the article. Deuteronomy 33 and verse 29. Happy thou, happy art thou, O Israel, who is like unto thee. O people say by the glory, how about Shion Shai? Who is the shield of thy help and who is the Lord? And who is the sword of thy excellency? And thy enemies shall be found liars unto thee, and thou shalt tread upon their high places. Okay, so we're treading on these devil's high places, man. This word, man, this word is sharper than any two-edged sword. Hebrews 4 and 12, man. This word is devouring them, and they can't handle it. <laughs> it's getting hot for them. So now what they got to do, they got to shut down anybody that speaks the truth. And really, this is all pointed to the men of the Lord, man. Okay? Jeremiah 5 and verse 14. Wherefore, thus saith the Lord, and how about she all shy power of hosts? Because ye speak this word, the truth. Behold, I will make my words in thy mouth fire, and this people would, and it shall devour them. They're getting devoured by this word. They're getting devoured by the truth. And they can't handle it. So now, what they want, they want the hey, <laughs> Anybody who speaks out against them and whatever they're doing, the wickedness, they want them gone, silenced, okay? So let's read a little bit more. It says, and famously described as the biggest expansion of domestic surveillance since the Patriot Act, the new FISA bill being pushed by the JWO's lobby contains added language that will basically criminalize free speech that upsets Zionists. Unbelievable. It also compels an, an enormous range of U.S. businesses to start acting as NA, NSA, National Security Agency, spying on behalf of Israel. Wicked, man. Unrighteous decrees. So they want to silence people, man. Many Americans have no idea that the Conference of Presidents of major american jwo organization even sent the letter nor are they aware of the legislation being pushed once words get out there is likely to be a major outpouring of opposition to it exactly because you're taking away these people's rights to speak man freedom of speech and that's a part of the first amendment man freedom of speech so do your part. No, I'm not going to do that. All right. Anyway, according to the report, many Americans have been speaking out against the legislations, but to no avail as both chambers of Congress pass it with flying colors and a show of bipartisan support. 
Republicans rarely agree with Democrats and vice versa, except when it comes to matters related to Israel. Both major political parties have been brought by Israel, which is why they are most, mostly all Israel first as opposed to Americans first. Yeah. And hey, your, your political parties are just you know, the left wing and the right, right wing are nothing but just two same, hateful, two same wings on the same hateful bird, man. Okay? They working together. Okay? Let's prove that. Let's go to Revelation. Revelation. I think it's 13 and 11, I believe. Yeah. Come on. Revelation 13 and 11. I beheld another beast coming up out of the earth. And he had two horns like a lamb, and he spake as a dragon. Yeah. Those two horns represent the political party system, man. Okay? Yeah. The Republican and the Democrats, they, they, they come as you, you know, thinking that they're for you, that they're speaking the same agenda as you. But, hey, yeah. They're against you Americans, man. So, <laughs> look. We're coming to the famine of the word, man. We're close. These devils are about to shut this word down, man. Let's go here. Amos 8 and 11. Behold, the days come, said the Lord, how about she all shall have power, that I will send a famine in the land, not a famine of bread, nor a thirst for water, but of hearing the words of the Lord, how about she all shall. So we're getting very, very close to the famine of the word being urshed in, man. We're close. Time is winding down. The days are speeding up, man. Okay? For the elect's sake. Verse 12. And they shall wander from sea to sea, and from the north even to the east, they shall run to and fro to seek the word of the Lord, and how about she all shy, shall not find it. Pretty soon you're not going to find them in the Lord on these YouTube platforms or, and none of these platforms, man. Because it, <clears throat> excuse me, because everybody get ready to shut down all these platforms, man. They're about to stop people from literally speaking out. And really, this is all targeted to the men of the Lord, man. Okay? Because the men of the Lord, hey, we're really bringing out these devil's wickedness, man. So they're about to get ready to pass unrighteous laws and unrighteous decrees. Let's get that. Isaiah 10 and 1. Woe unto them that decree unrighteous decrees and that right grievousness which they have prescribed. Yeah, unrighteous laws. Okay? <clears throat> Let's go to Isaiah, not Isaiah, but Psalms chapter 94 and verse 20. <clears throat> Psalms 94 and verse 20. Shall the throne of iniquity have fellowship with thee, which frameth mischief by a law? Yeah, and that's what these devils are doing. They're framing mischief by a law, man. Okay? Unrighteous laws, unrighteous decrees. So, <laughs> yeah. Let's see, anything else in here? Yeah, let's read a little bit more. It says, um, yeah, let's, let's see it here. It's, excuse me, it says, in order to protect the safety and security of Israel, as well as to protect the JOOs and the U.S., the JOOs lobbies wants Section 702 of FISA to be renewed immediately. <laughs> this prohibiting anti sim at colleges and university campus campuses. Florida Governor Ron DeSantis quietly passed anti anti semi legislations in the Sunshine State while Americans were distracted by the the you see that the C one nine. One can only imagine what the wailing wall kisser has planned for Floridians who are caught opposing Israel genocide. Yeah. So see, they quietly passing unrighteous decrees, man. <laughs> Come on, man. Unbelievable. So hey, this is where we at, man. Plus, they messing with brothers' channels, man. Messing with me. Can't even. 
you know, share lessons now. Without that stupid thing popping up. Now, that wasn't even doing that. Because as long as I've been sharing lessons and long, long as I've been on, that ch on my channel, that has not been doing that. It wasn't until after I got a strike on that channel. I think that was about a few months ago. And you know, when I got my channel back up, that's when it started doing that. So, psh, unbelievable. Anyway, but hey, it is what it is, man. It is what it is. We ain't gonna worry about it because we're gonna continue to go on, man. The hell with these damn devils. These devils can't stop this truth from coming out. Like it tells you in uh, 2 Corinthians chapter 13, verse 8. You can do nothing against the truth but for the truth. Let's read this. Revelation 12 and 12. Therefore rejoice ye heavens and ye that dwell in them. Woe to the inhabitants of the earth and of the sea. For the devil has come down unto you, having great wrath, because he knoweth that he had but a short time, man. So these devils, they got a short time. So now they trying to push... More laws, more regulations, and all this shit, man. Which is crazy. Now you need to, you know, <laughs> verify your channel. The channel you've been on, okay? To even, it's wild. So, these devils are through, man. They hurt. That's all it is, man. So, let's see. Anything else I got? Hmm. Let's get one more, man. Let's get one more. And we're going to close it out. I ain't intending to make this long. Isaiah 13, verse 2. Lift ye up a banner upon them high mountain. Exalt the voice unto them. Shake the hand that it may go into the gates of the nobles. So this truth, this gospel has reached into the gates of the nobles, man. And now they're trying to pass laws and regulations and rules to try to shut the men and Lord down, man. But hey, it's not them that's going to do it because the Lord Yahweh Shin Yahshai is going to do this. Okay? It's him that's causing this to happen. Yahweh Shin Yahshai. He's about to shut the mouths of the prophets. Let's get this. Ezekiel 3 and verse 26. And I will make thy tongue to cleave to the roof of thy mouth, that thou shalt be dumb and shall not be to them a reprover, for they are a rebellious house. And hey, two thirds of our people are rebellious, man. Okay? So, it's over. Esau knows his time is up, man. So, he's trying everything in his power. But, at the end, he's already lost, man. He's already lost. <laughs> he's, he's done. It's over for him. Okay? So, with that, I'm going to end it here. I pray his lesson was edifying and straight to the point. Okay? And I also wanted to show you, y'all, you brothers out there, what's going on, you know? With that, you know, the whole situation, all right, I have to go to my uh, backup channel and start sharing lessons, you know, on my other backup channel, man. But nevertheless, man, <laughs> it does hurt, man. Anyway, I pray this lesson was edifying straight to the point. All praises and glorifications go see how about some young shine. I shimmer cock with dots is on to the next one. Sean Wong, Kwame Yashrala, and Wild Baba Ball. Sean Wong.